Klože. Jo. Night time. Ha? Huh? Sleep. Okay. Also here has some beef. No. Oh. That is mighty nice of you. Wait, which bed is mine? The darker one uh, or the lighter one? Whichever one you want, baby. <sighs> I want the <laughs> darker one. Yeah. Perfect. Okay. Well, since I'm up here, actually, I had a point to make. Man, you are cooking up a storm. I need to... I have two pieces of iron, and I'm going to make an iron sword, and then I am ready to go. But that's not the point I wanted to make. Oh, man, you are just shiny on the spot today. Uh, I put some coal in here. Oh, you already... Wow. Okay, you don't have to be that Johnny on the spot. <laughs> okay, so I think we should establish two things today. Because yesterday we established my chicken mine shack of love. Which I think looks stupendous. Uh, also, I unnecessarily made a nice little birch path to the chickens. I don't know if you saw that, but it's it's pretty sweet. Yeah. So I think today we both need a project, and my project is going to be a farm. I'm going to grow wheat. We need bread, and we need seeds for chicken lovemaking. Yep. I guess I'll work on a house then. Where are you going to put the farm? We want them to be near each other. <sighs> yeah. So here's what I'm thinking, and call me crazy, but there's this lovely hill here. Okay. Mm-hmm. I think if you build this hill up, you know, like shape it a little bit, uh, it would, ooh, free arrows. It would kind of be like overlooking the water and stuff here, right? So it's not a terrible yeah. spot, and it's close to our mine shack of love. And then, so maybe in the ground, like right here, between the two, like I'm going to level this out to the same level as the mine shack of love, and, um, Put the farm here, so it's between the mine shack and the house. And then, yeah, you just build a house up there on the hill. All right. Does that, that make sense? That sounds good, yeah. All right. Outstanding. Hold on. Ready? Ready? And break. And break. Oh, what? That's not how we <laughs> break. Oh, there's a smithing table. What the hell is a smithing table? Uh. I can make one. Make one, then. What is this monstrosity? There's what a smoker as well. Upgrade gear? What? Oh. Hold on. I have to test something. I have to test something. Oh, my God. 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 Uh, mm. I, need, I need wood. I need wood. I need it, wood. It doesn't. It, I can't upgrade stone to iron. I no, 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 no. Oh, that's what I was thinking. Yeah, I can't do that. I wanted to see if I could upgrade wood to something else, too, though. Well, what does this do? Put a shovel in there. Maybe it, maybe it has to be damaged. Hold on, let me put my axe in there. Nope. So it's not for repairing stuff. Interesting. Okay, well, we'll solve that riddle later on. I wasn't That wasn't really what I was actually trying to do. What did I come in the house to actually do? Oh, yeah, make a shovel, because I'm terraforming. Hmm, here. I made a smoker. What does that do? It. I think it cooks food quicker than in a smelter or a furnace. Oh. I feel like we should be putting this stuff in a house. Ooh, yes. I, I, I wanted to... I, I mean, it's a smoker. I wanted to see if it made smoke or something. Yeah, that cooks way faster. Oh, okay. Well, cool. I can dig it. The question is skill. Can you dig it? <laughs> can you dig it? <laughs> yes. Can you dig it?
God, there's so many chickens around here. Just keep picking up eggs. Because I will eventually make cake. That's secretly what this whole mm -hmm. let's play is about. The last episode is us eating a slice of cake. The end. Yeah. Because that was the I mean, first recipe that the game told me I could make. Before I even had a piece of wood in my hand, I had an egg. <laughs> the very first recipe that I quote-unquote unlocked was for cake. And I will be damn poop. <laughs> <laughs> Good save. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's so hard to be kid friendly okay it's getting dark i'm coming home so your house is going to be kind of elongated when you get up there you'll well you're mm -hmm. there so it's you can make a house that's seven wide and that'll leave space for two blocks on either side i've flattened out the platform for you a little bit so your house could be seven wide but you can make it as long as you want you'll just have to extend the back um and then when you uh and then we'll probably have to smooth out the other sides because yeah it, it'll have a bit of a cliff but i pyramided the space that i needed for my farms farms <laughs> and then so there's going to be a path and a staircase that's leading directly up to what should be the middle of your house um so the, the, it'll be a uh, birch path that's leading up to your door. And then, but you can make the house out of whatever you want. I don't, I mean, it can be whatever. I'm just, I'm keeping a theme. So I'm using birch for the, the pathing for everything. This okay, so this is tough. the center of your house, right? I kind of put little nubs to dictate the size. Yeah, okay. I see what you're doing here. Okay, so yes, to answer my question, this is... Of course. Correct, yes. I don't know what material I want to build out of, though. Life's great questions, friend. Yeah, we don't... Well, we don't have much. We have acacia, oak, and birch right now. And, and rain. Great. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh! Uh, what the? Would you? Yeah. There are men. Men? Yes. Men. Over there. Men? Like uh, villagers? They have crossbows. Crossbows. Yes. See that? I do. One of them has a huge head. I think that's a sign or a banner. Oh, I... yeah, he has a huge head on his head. You're correct. Uh, I am going to ignore them for the yeah, moment. Yeah, we're going to sleep. That's a good idea. I'm going to sleep, and I feel like this will be a good time to make some sort of an armor, yeah? Uh, yeah, we have a good amount of iron, or at least we I have, should. I have some. Um, uh, hold on. Let me see what I can make here. So I'm going to make... Do you have any iron on you? Yeah, I got seven. Here, oh. I'll just... Give it all to you. Yeah, give it all to me. I'm going to divvy it up and just make what I can. So uh, I'm going to make each of us a helmet. And then that leaves us with 14. So that's enough for pants, right? So we're going to do... We each get a, a helmet and pants. Ah, hey. look at us. All right. So I think we should find out if these men... Are hostile. There's a witch behind them as well. I see a witch oh. over there in the trees. Okay. Well, we know witches are not friendly. All right. I'm going to circle around them and just murder the witch. Okay. That's good. Oh. They're making noises. Wow. 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 Oh. Okay. Oh. Yeah. They are definitely shooting crossbows at me. Uh, they're also shooting each other because they're bad at aiming. <laughs> I am poisoned. Mm. From the witch. Let's just 
switch out for that. Ow. Sneak attack. Killed one. Hey, I got another chain. And a crossbow. Ow. 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 Wait, you oh, picked I up a crossbow? Armor. Yeah. I also have a a uh, effect called Bad Omen. What does that do? Uh, I have no idea. It doesn't say. Oh. Hmm. Okay. Here, have this ominous banner. I don't know that I want an ominous banner. Oh, it is literally an ominous banner. <laughs> That's literally what it's called. Uh, I'm putting that in storage. I don't want an ominous banner on me. Neither do I. I have a okay. crossbow now. I mean, that's cool. Uh, I, I can definitely get behind that. Oh, also, I found gifts. Gifts? You? Yes, here. Yeah. Oh, oh, excellent. Okay. Can I turn them into seeds? Yes. Okay, well then, shoot. I forgot about pumpkins. Because I was going to make half of this farm over here carrots and the other half uh, potatoes. But I totally forgot about pumpkins. Ooh, I also forgot about watermelons. Oh, man. Oh, boy. <laughs> <laughs> Feel Got like... Another farm for those. I think this is adorable, by the way. It know. looks nice with the with the stairs. It's interesting. Yeah, little bridges going through. I mean, obviously, you lose farm plot. Because you have a but, row going down the center, but it also gives yeah. it a nice walking path that you're not like walking on the crops themselves and um, divides them, you know, neatly so that you can have different, you know, crops or whatever. So I kind of, I kind of dig it. Hmm, no. Well. Scale's starting to figure out his house situation, but I have figured out my farm situation, and I feel pretty good about it. It's different. I've never... I just wanted... I wanted to try to do things different. I mean, it's been a long time since we played. Obviously, things... There's things in the game that we're not used to. Like, I'm not used to having to fight guys with crossbows. Like, so... Already, we're experiencing things that are new to us that people that have been playing Minecraft this whole time would be, like, painfully aware of. But... Um, but yeah, I feel like because everything's so new, like, I don't want to just like do the same stuff I always used to, you know what I mean? Yeah. So I feel like Switch I'm already off. Already, I'm, I'm already, yeah. And I feel like I'm already getting there. Like, honestly, back in the, I mean, when I played FTB, I cared about farming because it was used as a power source, but in vanilla Minecraft, like, I never really cared that much about farming, and I never really tried to make any kind of, like, food recipes. Like, I would just occasionally find a good patch of cows and slaughter them and then move on with my life. Mm -hmm. So, I'm looking forward to, you know, really properly going about everything and not just all throwing everything together all willy-nilly. So, I'm feeling good so far is the point that I'm making here. Okay, well, the sun is setting. We do not obviously have a house yet, but Scale, you're you're off to a good start. I can see what you're going for here. Obviously, you're experimenting with different wood types, trying to figure out what you like and don't like, but I see the outline of it, and I love it. I love what I'm seeing here on the outline. I love that we're not just going for like a straight-up rectangle, that you're kind of creating rooms. Good, good on you, sir. I think I'm going to head off and call it a day. All right. I think I feel like I'm I feel like we're established enough anyway. I mean, we always have the chicken mind shack of love. Like that's never going to not mm -hmm. be a thing. So I enjoy this dynamic lighting that I can walk around with a torch in my hand. Mm -hmm. And you can put it in your offhand as well. So you can still have like a sword. Out. What? Yeah, you can put whatever you want in your offhand. Shut up. O M G. So I can literally be holding this and mining. Yep. Oh my word. Why did I not know that? <gasps> That's so helpful. Yeah. All right. 
Well, that's the note that I want to end on because I feel like that's great. Hmm. And there's a witch over there. Amazing. I'm going to not attack the witch because there's also skeletons and I'm going to get poisoned and then they're going to finish me off. So I'm going to go hide in the chicken mine shack alone and you change the color of your bed. Yeah. Okay. Well, I'm going to bed anyway. So good night, Skill. Wait. Good night.